We're at the San Joaquin Marsh, a system of constructed wetlands in the middle of Orange County, California. Traditionally, constructed wetlands are used to remove nutrients such as nitrogen and phosphorus from water, but that's not why we're here today. We're interested in something else that's in the water, dissolved organic matter. When plants and algae die and begin to decompose, they release organic matter into the water. When this organic matter gets hit with sunlight, it enters a highly reactive excited state known as a triplet state. This triplet state organic matter can react with contaminants such as pharmaceuticals and actually break them down right here in the environment. We use a nanosecond laser to investigate these reactions and learn more about them and how long they take. If we understand the fundamental science behind what's going on, then we can re-engineer these wetlands to become a natural, sustainable way of treating water with only the sun as an energy source. My name is Steven Timko. I'm a National Science Foundation Graduate Research Fellow, and this is how I'm helping to shape the future of sustainable water use.